all right so in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how to put two pictures side by side like the ones you can see on your screen right now all right so with that said let's begin so the app we're going to be using for this is um this one you can see on the screen um it's free the only thing you're going to have issues with is ads so because of the ads i normally walk offline so i don't get interrupted while i walk so as you can see it has like 4.2 out of 5 stars and some really good reviews all right so the first thing is to open the app and um, let it do its thing and ask you for permissions to see your pictures so just tap this option right here and it's going to ask you for permission to view all pictures on your phone then tap allow so i already created a folder of pictures that i'm going to be using for this video so i'm just going to tap this button and find the pictures all right so these are the pictures that i'll be using the pictures that have dogs in them are portrait pictures while the ones that of me and my friends are landscape pictures i couldn't find any stock photos that i could use for the landscape example so i had to use mine anyways i'm going to start with the portrait ones and then i'll show you how to use the landscape one okay so i'm going to select two pictures now one and two as you can see they are down here you can remove them if you want if you accidentally selected pictures that you didn't want to select i'm just going to add them to the list of pictures i want to use and then tap this button here so you see it automatically just aligns the picture but you can adjust the picture the way you want and when you're done just tap outside and if you want to adjust this one you can tap it when you're done tap outside the box and there are lots of options you can play with down here like i explained earlier the layout is this is for portrait pictures so if you tap the layout and uh, this is the one we are currently using if you tap this one you see the picture is going to look a bit odd so you want to always use portrait for portrait pictures and um, if you want to swap the pictures just tap any of them and then tap swap so you see they're going to change positions There are a bunch of other options that you can play with like for the pattern it's just going to create uh, patterns for your borders so i'm just going to tap let's see this pink one so you see the borders now uh having the pattern that i just selected you can also choose colors to change the color of the border and then if you don't want to use color you can use blur to take the same image that you have and blur it you probably won't be able to notice that it's the same picture but um Let's see if I increase the space and then change the blur. Yeah, you can see the dog behind. So the blur is actually taking the picture that you've put in, maybe the first one, and then blur it so it can look like a nice background. So I just showed you what one of the space options can do. It's just to create this, make the borders a bit wider. You also have the size of pictures, you can make them really small or big. And then the corners will just give it this nice round edge. So just play around with it until you have what you really want. And then there are other options as well. I wouldn't really play with these ones because they make the pictures look weird, but some may make them look great, like this one 30 by 2 just play around with the ratio all right so next we have the text option so just tap text and then tap this to write what you want to write I already have good boy written here so I'm going to put that down here and um, then I'm going to create another text that says good boys and I'm going to put that on the right so you don't have to tap that to do it just make sure you have the option outside here if you don't see the option just tap anywhere outside the, the main picture so tap text again and this time i'm going to write good boys and then put it down here you can change the color of the text just by swiping the bars up here so let's say i wanted um green and then tap ok so i mean green is a terrible color here but you get the point so you can choose whatever picture you want when you're done adjusting and um creating the perfect picture just come up here where it says save and tap it and it's going to automatically save the picture for you you can tap no thanks you're going to find the picture in a folder on your phone but just go through your gallery and you see the picture there so now let's talk about landscape pictures 
So to create landscape pictures, I'm going to use these pictures I have here of me and my friends. By default, it selects the portrait setting for you, but just tap this one and now you can see a bit clearer. So you can adjust the picture the way you want it to be. And like that. And I already explained how to play around with the options down here. So when you're done, just come up here and tap save. It's going to save the pictures for you. And if you want to share it, you can share it from here directly or from your gallery. So I'm going to show you in the gallery now. Okay, so here they are. Alright, if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to the channel. And I'll be seeing you guys next time. Alright, bye-bye.